Hey everyone, in this video, we'll be talking about how to install the A3 framework. So let's head over to the documentation, which is available at docs.a3labs.com. I also have my terminal open at right side of my screen. As we go through the documentation, I'll install A3 engine in my system. You can tag along and install at your end too. Okay, so let's do this. We first need to ensure that we satisfy two prerequisites. The first is Python version. We need Python version 3.7 or above. If we do not have Python, we can install the latest version from python.org. We can follow the link provided here. If we already have Python, we can check its version by running this command in terminal. Depending on our system's configuration, we might have to use Python 3 instead. So I'm trying this command now. Python 3 dash dash version. Okay, so I can see that I have Python 3.10. Great, this requirement is already satisfied. The next requirement is a virtual environment manager. There is support for two virtual environment tools, pipenv and conda. Since pipenv is a preferred tool, let's install pipenv. We'll run this command. Again, depending on our system's configuration, we might write pip or pip3. For my system, I'll have to write pip3. So I'll write pip3 install dash dash user pipenv. Okay, so I see that pipenv is already installed my, in my system. Great. So both the requirements are satisfied. On another note, my terminal is cluttered. So let's clear these commands. Sorry, clear, okay. The next thing to do is install a three CLI. Since we're using pipenv, we'll go to this page, install a three using pipenv. Okay, so the first thing we have to do is create an empty project directory. Let's call it my app. We'll follow this command mkdir my underscore app. Sorry, it already exists. So let me use another name. My new app. Great. Now let's go inside this directory and install a 3CLI here. So we'll do cd my new app. And then pipens install a three. So we can see that a three CLI is getting installed. Great. Perfect. A three framework has been installed successfully. Now we can go ahead and start using it. We'll cover it in the next video. In the meantime, you can visit the documentation to learn more. For example, how to install a three framework using Conda. If you faced any problems during installation or have any other queries, you can join the community in Slack and reach out to us there. The links are available here. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.